everybody, it's Lily with LadyDayOasis.com. I very quickly um, wanted to do a quick application and review of a product that I've recently kind of fell in love with. Um, it is their Mood Struck Fiber Lash Mascara or 3D Fiber Lash um, Mascara System. It actually comes in like this little case. It's all kind of cutesy um, and then there's two um, pieces to the the um, to the product I wanted to show you and what can like what you can expect if you choose to purchase the product um, so that you kind of know what what to expect and what's going on and stuff so before I show you how to apply it I just wanted to very quickly um, go over what comes in the box so um, like I said they come in um, this little case and it has a little instruction packet in it and basically the instructions are pretty straightforward but there are to me I feel like um, there are some little how to um, uh, how to tips and, and techniques that you can um, use to get the best results so inside of the little case is the um, unique mood struck translucent gel and it actually or translucent transplanting drill and what it actually is it looks when you open it up it looks like a mascara pencil um, but the bristles are really really close together and it's so it's a very thickening brush um, and to be well I'll save that part to the end never mind um, but that was that's what you can expect and then the other thing that comes with it is the unique mood struck natural fibers and if you open it it also looks like a mascara pencil or brush but as you can see there are little tiny fibers on the actual tool so um and that's all that comes with it that's all that comes with it um but together it is a very powerful tool so let's go ahead and get started with the application i will um, talk you through that and then at the end of the application process i will give my full um, opinion about the product yikes i look like i am dead without any eye makeup so we're gonna fix that first thing we're gonna do is apply my normal uh, mascara which is the mary Kay love lash mascara I love this mascara because it is a separating, lengthening mascara. It is The brush on it is designed to separate my lashes and make them look longer rather than looking fuller. The instructions in the unique um, little catalog that I showed you actually talks about using a separating pencil or comb, sorry. Um, this mascara replaces that step for me. You, separating my lashes, I'm going to put it on both of my eyes. And let it dry I'm also going to apply it to um, the bottom lashes because I don't do the fiber lash mascara on my bottom lashes at least I haven't experimented with them they usually stand out okay on their own just with a little coat of mascara so yeah this brush is really designed to open up my eyes and open up um, those lashes and also so that when I go to put on the other product I don't have to do a whole lot of work because my lashes are already separated and ready to go the next step after your regular mascara is to wiggle on a little bit of the transplanting gel I am really gonna focus on the tips of my lashes this is what is going to allow those fibers to stick to my lashes. So I really want to make sure that I'm focusing on lengthening and elongating my lashes. As you can see, I've switched now to using the fibers. I'm applying the fibers, really focusing on the tips. I apologize for my face being cut off and I know it's hard to see, um, but I'm really working the brush bristles against the tips of my lashes I don't need a filling effect because my lashes are already full but I do need the lengthening effect so those fibers are literally just laying on top of the tips of my lashes the next step is then to seal those fibers in place we don't want any fallout we don't want anything um, coming off throughout the day and making our eyes look dark so you need to put another coat 
of the transplanting gel. And again, focusing just on the tips, the same areas that you applied the fibers, now you wanna put that gel right over that to seal those in. Again, you may notice I'm only doing one eye at a time. You don't want that transplanting gel drying in between applications. So be sure to do one eye at a time and you will get great results. I really do like this product. I think that it is very easy to use. It's pretty simple to use. Once you know what you're supposed to be doing, you're gonna get the results that you want. My lashes look so much longer. It is insane. But again, I think the, the key is knowing what results you're gonna be looking for. I'm looking for length, so I'm focusing on length. So now that you know how to apply it um, and the best kind of techniques to use in applying it, I will say practice makes perfect. So I use it um, pretty much every day. I don't particularly care for false lashes and I kept seeing video after video after video of people, you know, finishing off their gorgeous look with false lashes, but I just do not have time to fiddle with that in the morning. And I understand practice makes perfect, but I just don't even wanna make that a habit in my life because it's not the best thing for my eyes. It's not the best thing for my lashes. So, um, so rather than trying to learn that very artful skill of applying lashes every day, I looked for something else. And the, um, the 3D lash um, mascara that I got from a friend, that is a consultant for um, Unique Cosmetics, um, I am totally happy with. Uh, it did take me some time to get used to um, any fallout or anything like that um, and making sure that I'm really sealing those fibers to my lashes so they uh, don't have fallout throughout the day and also so that um, I get the best clean look. Um, the other thing is the more that, again, the more that you use it, the better you get at applying it. So. Don't be afraid to try. Um, if you are looking for an alternative to um, false eyelashes, this is a super great choice. But it makes a huge, huge difference. It makes the basic look go to a dramatic look in minutes. So, all right, that's my spiel. I give it a A minus. The only thing that I would change about this particular product is the brush. I wish that there was a separating brush um, feature and I wouldn't have to use a comb or put on my separating um, mascara first. So if uh, Unique, if you're looking for any types of suggestions, that would be awesome. All right, thank you so much for watching guys. Have a great day.